Hi all, welcome back to my Newcastle career mode on Football Manager 2020 Mobile. As you can see, we're lying ninth in the table at the moment. We were seventh the last time we looked. Um, a few games have been played. We don't play until the Sunday against Man United. Who are currently in 15th, so we do have a, a decent chance as we're at home. Um, but one player I'm really pleased with at the moment is Daniel Kinsek. Top scorer, scored five in his first four games. Can't complain about that really. So I have the starting 11 here. Again, I'm trying to keep the same team. They're doing really well at the moment. Then I fancy what chances here against Man United at St James's Park. So here we we'll go, here's kickoff. Oh, a quick attack there from Man United. Well, we're going to get a very early goal. Man United on the attack again. Having the upper hand in this game so far, and that's it. All the cells is putting his own net to give Man United the lead after 13 minutes. To be fair, it's been all Man United this game so far. James put in a wicked ball into the box. Lascelles somehow came off him and beat the Provka at the his near post. 1-0 Man United. Can Newcastle go on attack? No, Man United get it back. McTominay, oh, he's put it over. Nearly 2-0 there for Man United. 35 gone. It's Man United here on the attack once again. Tony plays under Pereira. And it's actually Ingalo who gets the second. Newcastle's defence once again, letting them down. Manchester United could be getting the three points. This will be the full time whistle. We haven't been in the game at all. No real highlights for us. It looks like Man United to do. They go away with three points. That'll boost them up the table a bit. Disappointed evening for Newcastle there. Second game in this episode Norwich away. The only change I've made is Hayden's coming for Bentleb. Bentleb's struggling a bit with, with fitness. Let's see if we'll bounce back from that poor defeat from Man United in the last game. Here we go. Castle here, free kick, Shelby Ott, Mariga. Shelby's just blasted it, came off the keeper, Mariga there to pounce on it. 1 0 Newcastle. Newcastle get their second. Ginsek takes the shot on the edge of the box, bounces again off the keeper, can't hold it, follows it up on his own shot, places it in 2 0. And that's his sixth of the season. Norwich pull one back, free kick on the edge of the box. Played on the box brilliantly. Header 2 1, game on. And Newcastle see this out. To proper long pull up or soon Maximin puts it wide. And again on the attack. And that's it. Final whistle, Newcastle 2, Norwich 1. The way to Sheffield United in this game now. Bentleb gets his place back in the team. Let's see how we do in this game. Newcastle 1 0 up through St. Maximin. Ball out wide and he's there back post. There was a replay earlier on after two minutes. That man, John Joe Shelby, getting himself sent off after VAR had a look at it. And as I speak, another VAR decision gives Sheffield United a free kick who score from it. Norwood makes it 1 1. And Sheffield United go 2 1 up. Ball into the box there. McBurney places it past to Pravka. From 1 0 down, they take the lead 2 1. That's it, Sheffield United free kick. Oh, and it's McBurney again, second of the game. And third for Sheffield United. Taking advantage of this extra man. That's free play. That's it, full time. Sheffield United 3, Newcastle 1. Two defeats in a row so far, not good at all. Match day 8 in the league, back home against Crystal Palace. 
couple of changes made, obviously Shelby now banned, so Hayden comes in. Hola comes in for Jinsek, uh, Jinsek picking up an injury out for 10 days with a damaged shoulder. But I trust in Hola to, to put in a performance and be a good stand-in, so here we go. Going out, come in from Amaron. Born Hola is there, but just puts it wide. Whipped in, cleared. Hola's there, and Hola, is it, it's actually Hayden, he's taking it off, Hola. As we'll have a look at the replay here. Amaron with the corner. Comes out to Hola. Hola's turned his man. Hayden's picked up the loose ball and curls it into the bottom corner. 1-0. Newcastle get a corner. Can they get a second just before the end? Maybe another corner. Now Amaron will whip it in once again. And it's there, and Hola, second goal of the season, makes it three points for Newcastle. Almiron with a lovely ball in, just floated in. Near post, Hola's there, away from his man. 2 0, and probably three points for Newcastle. Final seconds of the game here. Seeing Maxman trying to chase that loose ball. Final whistle's gone. Newcastle get that win after two poor defeats and beat Palace at home 2 0. Away to Bournemouth now. Shelby back in the team after seeing his ban. Hayden comes in for Bent Lib, who's carried a slight injury. Let's get the match underway. Newcastle on the attack. Hola, out to Maximin, armour on. Winter corner. It's actually a whole lot of take it this time. Oh, plays it off the first defender. Almiron says, give me that. And I'll take it. Cleared away though. Almiron picks it up. Nothing comes of it. Gaden to Shelby. Playing to Hola. Hola's took a shot. Quite a tame one. Ramsdale claims nicely. Final moment of the game. Been quite a poor game to be fair, looks like it couldn't end 0 0. Neither team doing anything, that's the final whistle. Ball draw 0 0. One point gained, I suppose. We'll move on to the next. This will probably be the toughest game in, in this save so far. Home to Man, Man City. If we can keep the score down, I'll be happy. You know, they're, they're storming at the moment in the league. Let's see what we can do. Hopefully just damage limitation, yeah. Man City on the attack. To go and there we go. There's the first. City on the attack, go and To Sterling, put it in. And it's there, number two. Gabriel Jesus. Simple tapping really, lovely ball in by Sterling. As you can see go and one just out wide. Sterling, lovely ball in. Jesus gets in front of Dean, slots it home, 2 0 and 3 points. Castle with a late attack here maybe, no. The referee's probably gonna blow his whistle very soon. It's actually a foul on Hayden. No, it was actually Hayden that fouled. Okay. That's it anyway, final whistle goes. Another defeat for Newcastle as they go down 2 0. We're at Burnley now here. Need to start picking up some points. It's been a bit of a disastrous few games so far. Let's pick up the pace and get up this Premier League once again. Free kick to Burnley. Plays it long. What's this? VR. A free kick to Burnley. There it is, right on the edge of the box. But Newcastle managed to clear it. The Brad came out. Play the long ball, but to come back. Bond is there, you know, he's put it wide. Burnley on the attack once again. Cork to Hendrick. Hendrick to Bond, he's hit the ball. Newcastle lucky again here. Burnley. So much the better team. 
There's another attack goes. Barnes this time puts it away. Seconds earlier hits the ball. Not this time. Makes it 1-0 Burnley. Burnley back on the attack. Barnes to Hendrick. Hendrick plays Barnes again. He's getting past. Burnley managing to slot it between the Newcastle defenders. And Barnes makes it so easy. Slots it past to Bravka. Pretty similar to his first. That's 2-0. Uh, looks like another defeat. Final seconds of the game. Because we'll get a corner here though. And they get at least one back and that's it. St. Maximin. Horses. Video replay. Maximin alleged to have fouled the defender. Goal scratched off. Still 2-0 to Burnley. Riga. Can he get this ball in? Defenders there, clears it, full time whistle. 2-0 to Burnley. Newcastle having an atrocious time at the moment. It's game 11 here as Newcastle in 10th takes on 14th place Villa. I've just checked there, I thought uh, Jins Jinsek was uh, due to come back, but he's obviously picked up another injury. He's out for another two weeks with a groin injury. We're definitely missing him at the moment with the goals. So we need Hola to step in and do something here because this has been a very, very poor run so far. Let's get this game underway. Newcastle on the attack there here in the Shelby. Plays to Almiron. Plays in Hola. Oh, keeper saved it. Yedlin picks it up. Mariga to put it in. It's been cleared. Newcastle get the corner. Hola to take it. Plays in Maximin. That one will stand this time. Gets a near post header. 1 0 Newcastle. That's the better now in the attack here. And again plays it in. And Baston picks it up in the box. Swivels. Far corner. And that's 1 1 just before half time. Seconds left on the clock here. The long ball up. Can Holler get there? Oh, free kick. Pull back in, put it in. Oh, it's going straight to the keeper. That'll be pretty much full time. Rina kicks it out, and that's it. Some more points dropped by Newcastle. Dropping down the league rapidly at the moment here. It's a final score. Newcastle 1, Villa 1. So the penultimate game in this save. Rose goes back in the left back after recovering from his injury. Jinsek is on the bench after recovering. Might have to bring him on later on. Let's see how we'll get on. Be another free kick. Go on, let's stand over it to Coleman. I was looking at something here. Oh, it's a free kick, edge of the box. Can't ever capitalise on this. Digny. Calvin Lewin. Calvin Lewin just smacks that one. One eleven. And then with another attack there. Calvin Lewin plays it a keen. Edge of the box. Slams it home. Two nil. Things have gone from bad to worse for Newcastle, yeah. Comes from the throw in the other halfway line. Dove plays it, regardless him. Calvin Lewin to Keane. Finds our bottom corner, 2 0. Another attack by Evan. Regardless him. Calvin Lewin, he's turned, edge of the box, 3 0. And that's pretty much game over. Castle get a throw here. Deep in evidence half. Armour on turns and it's there. Pulls one back. That's only his first goal of the season. But with 20 minutes to go, is there a glimmer, glimmer of hope? You see here, Yedlin takes the throw to Hola. Plays it Armour on the edge of the box. Finds the near corner. 3 1. Everton on the attack. Gomez plays it. Marcel's is. Push for Carlison. 
Evan win a free kick, 15 to go. As Gomez is just shot from about 35 yards. Caught everyone unaware, and that's 4 1. We'll get the replay. Look at this. Just places it down. Nobody's organised things. Bang, I'll have a try. And look at that. Unbelievable. Maria Gaff to Shelby to Almiron to Haller. Plays it in. Almiron's there. Second of the game. Second of the season. 4 2. But with three minutes to go, it's only a consolation, really. It was well played. Lovely passing about, lovely ball in there by Shelby, Haller to Almiron, nips in the back post, slots it home 4 2. That's probably game over. Evan just passing it around, running down the clock. That's one more tack maybe from Newcastle. A little bit passing about here by themselves, They're not really doing anything with it to be fair. Evan can get it clear. Maybe one final attack for Evan here, maybe. Just Lewin, that's it. Another defeat again. Poor game. 4 2 to Everton. What do we do? What do we do? So, final game of this episode. Home to Brighton. Jinsek back in the team. Bentleb taking the place of Shelby, who has picked up a knock. Let's hope we can end this episode on a high. We haven't won in the last five games here so come on boys let's do it ball comes in oh and Duffy's just headed it wide casting down the attack armor under Hayden back to armor on Junsek oh he's caught offside anyway but good save by Ryan because of back on the attack Bentley plays out to Mariga plays it in the box Junsek is there in off the post the boy back from injury, back in with the goals, and Newcastle back to winning ways. As Bentley played it out to Mariga, Mariga to Jinsek, just knocks it out his feet, turns off the far post and in, 1 0. Throw into Brighton. My lovely save by Dubravka, trying to keep this clean sheet and three points for his team. Seconds to go. Can you castle hold enough to Pravka's running out there? Clears it up and that's it. The castle finally get that win. Jinsek back from injury. Gets the winner. Newcastle won. Brighton nil. So as you can see there we've dropped a tenth after quite a poor run of games. Don't forget, you know, we did only draw one and lose one prior to these games, so you can just see how bad this episode's been but obviously we'll plot on obviously what I'm trying to do is I'm trying to put a, an episode out each day I'll do roughly about three months gameplay so the next episode will be going through the January transfer window so if any of you have any suggestions of players I could bring in and um, players maybe I should try and get out uh, any comments is welcome any criticism you know any tips you know I'm more than welcome to take on board and we can try and improve this team together so as always like and subscribe and just one final shout out um, a lad that I, I met on FIFA about four years ago now and um, we've become good friends over the years he runs a channel as well called he's known as Lil Borg which is L-I-L then B O R G. I'll put a link in the description below anyway. He's doing a Sunderland career. Boo, I know. But um, yeah, you know, he's a good lad. Give him some support as well. You know, we're all in this together. So all support is always appreciated. So until next time, I'll see you later. Bye bye.